Hey, so what's going on guys? Back here with Drug Dog Reviews and welcome back to another video. So we are actually on our way to Dazzle to check on the Cifero A31 uh, because there was a minor gearbox leak uh, a couple of weeks ago. So I wanted to actually send it back in and actually give a check and see whether there were any leaking oil seals or something like that because it was definitely gearbox fluid and I didn't want the gearbox to go empty and risk damaging the gearbox yet again because I just changed to a new, uh, I say new old um, RB25 gearbox. So you know that cost a pretty penny and I didn't want to go damaging it, just you know, whacking it down the street and all. Uh, anyways, um, since it was also there, I also wanted to do the manifold, uh, stainless steel manifold as well as custom intercooler piping. If the budget does allow, otherwise I will stick with the current manifold and just do the intercooler piping. Since the front intercooler is already there but uh, somehow the piping is not installed, I don't know for some reason, which is kind of strange to me that the previous owner had the, uh, in fact, Apexi intercooler, which is not a very big intercooler but it is an intercooler nevertheless. So I think making use of it would be great and also actually make it functional, uh, not just for show. So I also went in to do my front adjustables to get them serviced which was a major concern for me considering that uh, they are blown now and if I continue driving it will actually damage the chassis itself, the frame and cause some cracks and all. I didn't want that to happen and I also plan to do ultra racing strut bars uh, probably in the weeks to come uh, if budget allows me of course. Uh, but anyways let's head over to Dazzle and I'll show you guys the car and uh, State is in right now. Alright guys, so we just arrived Dazzle and you can see my car is actually right there on jack stand. So they have taken out both the front absorbers for servicing. And it's a good thing they can actually get it serviced because uh, the front absorbers are actually big shafts and many of the shops didn't want to get it serviced for me because they said it might leak again. So they weren't confident enough in their work. Uh, but anyways, uh, the guys here at Dazzle actually managed to find one that is willing to actually get those adjustable service so I also heard from Ejab the boss that they are coming to do the intercooler piping measurements but they are not here yet but anyways they'll be doing custom intercooler piping so they will have to come here to get it measured uh, before actually fabricating it so you can see right here the intercooler is actually not connected to anything it hasn't been connected to anything and I wanted to make full use of this since it was just sitting here but you can see the intercooler is slightly slanting because of the impact you can see right here uh, previous owner actually had someone test drive the car and this got damaged somehow in the process uh, but they are able to actually knock the brackets back in place so that is a very good thing so I do want to get this intercooler working and also of course since it's already mounted it will give better cooling to the air and of course the cooler the air the better the engine performs in layman's term okay so that's basically about it nothing really much to see right here except the car is just sitting uh, right here it's been sitting for a while i suppose uh, hopefully to get this car back by this week and of course you can see my instagram account so if you do want to follow you can follow at godzilla underscore nitrate 9 Alright, so this has been a very quick update on the Cifero. Nothing really much to see right here. I will give you guys a full tour when the car is ready and ready to be collected. I am really excited to see the improvements, of course. And uh, that's all for this video. Hope you guys like this video. If you did like it, do give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to this channel for more content just like this one. And I'll see you guys in the next video.